Hey guys, it's Paul Jang. Just wanted to give you a preview of our land investing course. Um, it, it is a business, but you know, I like to operate it in a way that I spend at as least amount of time as possible um, and uh, leverage this into other streams of income. This is how my wife and I were able to quit our jobs. Our land investing course is in the description below if you're interested. Uh, there's different ones out there. Um, uh, some of them a lot more expensive than ours, other ones comparable to our price. Uh, feel free to check those out, but this is uh, how it goes. Um, each module is broken up into different sections. So we have the land framework, really good deals, due diligence, all, all these as different fields, but I'll just talk about them in general in different modules. Um, so with the land frameworks, there's two different ways to make money in land investing. It's going to be cash deals and owner financing deals. Cash deals are the things that keep your business running. You'll get huge influxes of, of cash, uh, especially if you deal with some of the bigger properties. Um, it's not crazy to pick up something for $10,000 and sell it for thirty dollars or $40,000. Um, so th that's the cash deals. I would say, though, that like your bread and butter will probably be the owner financing deals. It is how my wife and I were able to quit our jobs. Um, cash deals are great. You know, they give like a, an adrenaline rush. But, um, you know, stacking, uh, you know, $50 per month deals, $100 per month deals, $150 per month deals, $200, $250 $200 per month deals. When you start stacking these types of deals together, that's what allows you to basically quit your job. And so this course is really for the person that is having a W-2 job, uh, wants to get out of it, um, needs something that isn't going to take a lot of time. Uh, there's other businesses out there that if you quit your job right now, you had a little bit of cash saved and you were going to work and do more salesy type stuff like close deals you know, uh, uh, you could make money and get out that way, right? But you just replaced your work for another job. Uh, land inv the land investing business world is a more uh, of a, a longer term approach. Um, it's really to get yourself out and spend minimal amount of time so you can do other things with your time. Now, if you did land investing and, and did another business or of that some sort, or you just kept your job and getting promoted that way and did land investing on the side, I think it's a great way to, um, um, you know, a great add-on. So uh, you need to be able to find really good deals consistently. There's different ways you can do it. You can get um, um, uh, how this course basically approaches it is with direct mail. But uh, there's text messaging campaigns. There's virtual assistants that you could call. Uh, there's tax options, different things you can do there. But uh, this course is going to uh, – the most consistent way to do it is to do direct mail and uh, have that piece run in autopilot so you don't have to um, think about it so much. Um, it'll be almost uh, – it'll be like 95% autopilot, uh, the, the setup. So the due diligence check checker is basically how do you basically know that the deal that you're getting is good – and that there's no real issues or things things of that nature that you know you you have to look out for. Um, this is kind of the um, it, it's just a good good checker to basically see like hey is this a deal that I can move forward with or a deal that I want to take a step back. Module four is uh, all all the things that you'll need to sell your property. Uh, you'll, we'll talk about land listing sites, Facebook, Craigslist, um, uh, email. Right, it, everything that you'll kind of need to to get going with selling your property, uh, it's going to be over here. Your team of people, your your VAs. You don't have to do this, uh, especially in the beginning, but uh, you know if you um, if you want to get to the point where things are pretty much automated and you're just kind of managing here and there, like you know that kind of point, VAs could drastically. Uh, lower the amount of time that you have to be in your business and uh, you can do this very inexpensively i tend to hire vas from the philippines um, and doing it that way i pay somewhere between two to four dollars an hour uh, for the va and, and what they're going to be doing i've used vas to sell property i've used vas to do due diligence um, i used uh, vas to help me with some of the research and finding deals uh, all of this is kind of um, you know, basically you could run through it yourself and then eventually you'll, you, you'll want to hire some VAs to help you out with the business, um, especially if you have a job. 
self closings. This this section right here is worth uh, gold. Every closing that you do, you're, there's closing costs on the seller side and buyer side. And what you want to do is for some of the cheaper deals, close on things yourself. So if you have an offer out there, most of the sellers will generally um, expect that you pay all their closing costs because you know, you're buying it 25 cents, 30 cents, 40 cents on the dollar. So <clears throat> what you want to do over here in this, uh, um, in this portion is if you pick up something for 3000 and you pay closing costs for the seller and buyer side, that's, that's almost $2,000, you know, 1500, a thousand is probably going to be the lowest that you get. And, um, doing that for a property, if you pick up something for 3000 and it's, and it's $2,000 for closing costs, that's going to eat up a chunk of your profits, your, your margins. Um, so in those situations, it's better to self close. And, um, this session, this module kind of go over it. So if you could see, uh, it's broken up. You got two chapters, four lessons in this uh, module, four chapters, 15 lessons, three chapters, nine lessons, four chapters, 10 lessons, two chapters, four lessons, four chapters, um, uh, 15 lessons for this module. So, and then, uh, finally we have funding for your deals. Uh, that's going to basically talk about lines of credit, uh, borrowing using partnerships and also, um, if you want us to be a funding partner for you, we, we can do that as well. So uh, those are the, the different modules over here. And um, it, it's it's basically a run through for the land investing world. I, I try to take out as much as possible anything that isn't really imperative. Uh, some stuff out there will give you so much information that you get um, um just paralyzed with the sheer content and a lot of this stuff is is set up to limit the amount of subscriptions um other other costs that you might think is necessary but isn't necessary especially in the beginning uh, most of the other courses out there uh, generally will tie you up for a monthly subscription in different softwares uh, i'll just list some of them out uh, jack bosch he has a software He'll make you do your own mailers. At least, I don't know if he has an update yet. There's Land Academy. Go check them out. It's like $250 a month plus other additional softwares they'll, they'll want you to tie you into. GeekPay, same thing. I think they use Lob and um, uh, GeekPay and, and some other stuff that they'll try to tie you in with that. And, and coaching because, um, of, of course, after you buy a course, they'll try to upsell you. So... You know, there, there's different stuff out there. Check out the different things that you want to do. But this is really an essentials. Uh, someone that has a W-2 job of some sort, wants to build up investment income, wants to spend as least amount of time as possible without all the different fluff. Uh, if you want the fluff, this, this course probably isn't the one for you, um, at least by itself. Maybe I'll do some kind of add-on. But... This is kind of the uh, essentials land investing course. So that's it in a nutshell. It is how my wife uh, and I were able to get out of our jobs. Check it out in the description below if you're interested. Uh, take care. Have a good one.